but you do get a pretty solid body shot on that one. Um, like does it, it, it? It sinks in and stuff. What? Does it flinch? Flinch. Does it notice there's a body shot? Does it? Like, oh yes. Or it screeches out. It's very right. upset. So okay. yes. This one hurt. Chiron. That's five, and then a straight attack with the scimitar, which is plus four. Okay. Nineteen. That's, that's going to hit, yeah. And then, so that means it plus four. D6, yeah. Plus four. No, wait, plus strength. No, it's uh, finesse, so plus... Dexterity plus two. Five. Seven against red die. Seven damage against that one. It, it is dead. Yeah. Yes. Okay, and I only moved once, so that means I have <coughs> five more squares to move if I want to. Yeah, that's exactly where I planned on. And in the two. After that, though, it is. Oh, you got that it is like that. My guy. Yeah. I will move. Do I have line of sight to yellow there? I mean, all it says. If he's peeping around the corner, he can peep around the corner. And can they see that guy? If I wanted to take a hot check. Like so if he was peeping under him. They should, maybe they should both take a self check. Say if he was I'll looking take, over him. He was see, looking under him. Um, okay, so technically from right there, Hop Trice has half cover. Cause of okay. The yeah, that's it. Yeah. Give um, me a negative two or something on it? Yeah, essentially. So So this is on stealth check, right? Or hit on... No, it's just a hit. So you're doing stealth right now, so go ahead and do it. That's well, I'm not gonna get that. Yeah. So good. So now here's just to hit minus. Two. But I get I get that's, plus that's five. Hit anyway, so so, okay, yeah. yeah. I don't get so all I get's the the d six. Yeah. yeah. No sneak attack. Well, six. Which is what? Uh, eight. Four? Seven, eight. Yeah. No. No, this is not. Nine. 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 Six, seven, eight, nine. nine. Yeah, because I get plus three dexterity. This one has more than 20 health. No, they, he's only going to hit once. That one's only going to hit once. Yeah, I did that with a 10. Yeah. That was the first thing I did. Yeah, oh, he yes, he has 20 health. Yeah, yeah. he kind of struck it off. Yeah. The ogre had 70 health. I don't care. This one has more than 20 health. Are these things or y'all's No, nine. that's that, that's okay. zero. Nine. Yeah, it was hit like three times. Okay. Them. It should be out of there. And I only move. Eh. I'll just use, use one more five foot and then I'm done. Um, Herc, I need you. To, okay, first of all, you take uh, three damage from the cockatrice. I need you to roll a constitution save, please. Uh, 11, 11 is. Three. That's good. That's good enough. No petrification for you. Say what you say. Three. Uh, three, yes. And then you'll get hit by the other. Common you for six damage. Where you at? Four. 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 Nice. You have so much health, it's ridiculous. <laughs> mm -hmm. Love it. Take. Um, take is good. Herc. Time is so biting my ankles, so we yeah, just oh, the shit out of it. <laughs> <laughs> That's that's awesome. Seventeen. Seventeen. Nineteen. Nineteen. Okay, that's rage. Nineteen is a hit. And seven plus two. Mm-hmm. Twelve points to. Twelve points of damage is enough to kill the cockatrice. Yeah. Nice. Got rid of those motherfucking chickens. Quite true. Quite true. All we need now is KFC gravy with them. KFC gravy. <laughs> no, 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 
I pour the blue shit on it. Am I next? Cool. You and Raziel are next. Okay, yeah. I'm going for the kill. Great. Well, hold on, count your squares, brother. Okay. I, I mean, you were like, I was like, right there. Yeah. Like One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. To be on top of them. That's great. Okay. You can, yeah. Go ahead. Your first attack. That is a four plus my. What was that? Acrobatics for jumping on them? No. No. <laughs> That just went up. That would just be the attack. That's a miss. So okay, try please. your flare blows. That's a five. Nope. So, so he he's pretty dodgy, little goblin. You try and hit him, and he's, yeah, he's, he's just, just he's, he's pretty dodgy. Bouncing around. Duck right. and weave. That might give him a disadvantage over here in time. In yeah. time. No. Nope. Uh, Rosio. All right, so yeah, I want to shoot you. Yeah, kill that motherfucker. I see two dodges. I'm like, all right, I know exactly where he's gonna stand back up at. That should be an advantage, but it's not. I know it's not. It's a twelve plus seven. Yeah. yeah. So one d eight. Mm-hmm. One plus three. It's four, and he's not dead yet. Well, at least but you hit him. Nowhere. You hit him, and you hurt him. And he can't run. Uh, where did you hit him? Let's see. Okay. So you hit him in the shoulder. The shoulder. Uh, All right. right shoulder. His right shoulder. Yes. On your sass. <laughs> there it is. All right. Uh, Soren. So, he has a good shot. There's... Does he see anything else? Should it be a perception check to see if there's anything else here? Before he steps forward to shoot this guy. If you want to make a perception check, that is your action for that round. Oh, and no attacking? And no attacking. They're fine. I'm going to do that. Walk forward and make a perception check. Okay. Where are you walking? Towards the fire. Okay. I'm going to roll an 18. 18. There are no more enemies that you can uh, hear or see or any of that. So I, you're good. Nothing's here. Nothing is here. Alright, well then, I ready my bow and I'm ready to shoot this guy right here. Okay. Um, Chiron. Take a step out. Take a step out. And shoot him. First action is actually just to shoot, or uh, make a stealth check behind the half cover there, the, or the fourth cover of the corner, or whatever. Mm -hmm. this? No, he's, it's the Galadriel. This guy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. With an eight. Probably not enough, but... Plus stealth at the end? <clears throat> this is stealth. Six. Fourteen. And... So the stealth check is 14. It's plus... No, no, so 14. Okay, uh, you're good. Got it hidden? Okay, then shoot it, goblin. 18, 18. yeah, that's gonna yeah, hit. It's definitely a hit. And it's gonna be sneak attack and regular damage. Five Three, four, five. Plus two. Six, seven. That's enough. Okay. Especially because he's already been injured. Five. Yeah, I figured. It's not gonna lose. Good deal. Then that he stays exactly where he is. That concludes the combat. Okay. All right. There's no more creatures about. So it seems like most of their little troop of goblins and such were, were sent to attack. And, and he cleared it out. So I most would immediately them. look in this place and then look in this place, uh, just with like, after we've sat out here and rested right outside of it. So I'm right, first resting. Kind of look uh, this for, one. Okay, so for short one, rest, but short rest, if, if, if you need to spend to hit dice to heal, you can. Yeah. I didn't even need to hit. Well, Herc, I believe, is in here. Yeah, yeah Herc, yeah. myself. So yeah. roll a d12 for you, and I guess, you, whatever your hit dice is, I guess it's a d10 as a fighter. The fighters, I've been using a D8 for the hit, or, wait. Oh. At 12 is my maximum hit points, is that what it's a roll? Nope. What? 
What's your constitution? 14? Yes. Yes. So that means that your hit dice as a fighter is a d10. Okay. Roll the d10, and then you kill the equivalent number of that plus your constitution modifier. That's 9 plus 2. That's 11. So you rolled a 4? I'm 4. Yeah, I rolled a 7. Sorry. Now, um, and then once that happens, I would have us walk in in correct order to this building and clear it, and then these two. That is a reasonable path to choose. Are they empty or? Well, I'll get to that. First building. We'll do these numerically, I guess. Unless you have. Hey, conveniently, other, I did pick numerically. So some other means of doing this. So we walk in here. All right. Four doors. In room number one, I need a uh, perception check, please. Because, like, All right. pretty much everything in here, except for we where there have been cell goblin cell footsteps, is pitch black is, or what? It's really, like, thick dust. It's all over everything. Dust, okay. Um, layers and layers of dust. So give me a perception check. Eleven. Four. Ten. Eight. Nine. Anyway. Uh, so wait, what? So, yeah, you know we have about 10? I have 11. 11, okay. What about the two other characters? One and oh, nine. Oh, shit. What is and, aha, uh -huh, I need two in oh, hand. Perceptions plus four. Ooh, so he gets a 15. Saran was up there, he got a 15. Nine. So nine which is nine. plus two, 17. Wait, 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 what do you plus it plus? Saran was up there. Perception. Perception, okay, so that would be 12. Would be 12. Okay, so the the 15 that Soren got? Yeah. Under the layers of dust in the corner of the room is a small chest. Okay. Um, and in that chest, chest, the chest is unlocked. It's like a little... Uh, like near the cubic foot of space chest. It's a jewelry chest. Essentially. There's 50 silver. All right. So, I guess Room number two, um, and really outside of that, like, most of these rooms are just filled with rubble, and there's, like, maybe a table mm -hmm. or a chair that's really rotten and just covered in dust. It's just gross, you know, sinusy type. I heard you. Sneeze like Rose. Can um, I just, just, I mean, I doubt it'll make a difference, but can I make a real quick investigation check and look around? Or would that be a perception? Uh, what are you trying to do? I just want to look and see if there's anything hidden or, like, underneath a drawer. Okay, um, there's no tables or, or anything like that okay. in, in room one. Room two... Which I think is the bigger room. Yep. Yeah. Really big room. Uh, there's like uh, cots, or what used to be cots, like really moth-eaten, rotten. Just used to be a bedroom. Or barracks. Okay. Barracks. Room three, which is adjacent to the smaller room, was. Uh, other than like goblin, there's like goblin, a lot more goblin filth in this one, like, like excrement. It's like where they've been staying? Yeah. So it looks like. And the little room to the side is like a storage closet. Yeah. But there's nothing really there. Okay then. No. So All right. Building one is done. So we're going to walk up here. Which, which one are you doing first? Hold on. Okay, that's fine. So we're walking up here. Mm-hmm. Barbarian walks up here first. To this point, it makes right. a perception check. Cool. Does the, he notice the, anything about these to, two buildings? To the fountain? He's at the fountain. Okay. What did you roll? Eleven, 11 plus first. perception. Which is two more. Plus two. Thirteen. Okay. This is not very hard to, to discern. Um, the doors on the upper building, the northern building, one with a big pool there. Yep. 
have been recently used. The doors on the other side of the fountain are still have a fine layer of dust. Have not been like, There have been well, it it, it it looks like there have been finger markings around the, the locks of the doors. Not recent. But no one's opened. It. Nothing's been opened. What do you do? Well, pick pocket lock pick mother sir is gonna check those doors on the left. Is that uh Well then right off the bat I suggest that yes, I suggest he Carrion checks actually I would suggest he check that upper door, the one that hasn't been right now visited. I haven't checked it, yeah. I'm not no. saying I'm trying no, to No, to be the guy in there. So, um, Carrion, yeah. this character, should check these doors right here on the, the abandoned The two locked building. doors. Okay. Yeah. The ones that The two have, doors that... No like, one's open. You don't know that they're locked. They are locked. They... Yeah, all right. Okay. So, well, now that he's checked... And now that he sits, he's... Now he's going to try to open the, them. The orcs stand here, half orc, stand here in front of these doors, just chill in front of the fountain. Ready to go. The fountain obviously uh, does not have any water flowing out. Yes, yeah, yeah, it's just a little spot, a concrete drive. circle. Yeah. He's sitting right here in front of these doors, ready to roll. Anyway, are you going to jump up here right next here with him, or are you going to be on top of this building? Yeah. I mean, anything isn't really about to happen. For now. Something. Well, yeah, this is an so empty I building. Mean, well you could be in the, the top, or you can come behind him. That's but what I'm saying. We should. Get over here, so I mean, you're gonna well search the buildings. I mean, we're really shopping for information right about now. Yeah. Um, All right. I will need a uh, sleight of hand. He's sitting back. Uh, actually, I guess we'll need a stealth, stealth, uh, stealth check for picking the lock or whoever's going to do it. I would stealth suggest yeah. Chiron. That would well, Chiron gets plus five in addition to his current bonus. You want to hear roll for him? Six plus seven. You said. Plus, plus seven? five. Or plus five. Still, a, that's a plus eleven. Jeez. Yeah, roll. That's a seventeen. Mm -hmm. Plus eleven. That's, that's a very high roll. It, it makes no uh, sound. He cracks the lock with ease. relatively quickly, with ease. and you hear the little click, and the doors are now unlocked. And so he tries to open them carefully. Does that mm -hmm. take some acrobatics, yeah. or does it just no. open them you can quietly and carefully? Open. I mean, they're creaky, but just moves in There's and starts right, so, to explore so the house. Perception check on this one first, touching in, mm -hmm. and who's walking in second? Perception check, same character. Is an eighteen plus. Okay, uh, what's what's Kyron's perception? It is. Four. 18 plus 4 is 20 plus. Gotcha. Now, the thing about this area is that 22. It's considerably like the building is better built and the doors have been shut and locked for a long time. So, this was headquarters. There isn't much dust in here. It looks pristinely. There's been people here, here recently. No, they're just no, pristinely vacant. If they're, no they're one's been here for the time this place has yeah. been closed, it's been shut yeah. up, locked, there's no, and, and, and... And this building, you also notice, has no windows. None. These are just arbitrary hallways. Anyway, um... Ye well, yeah, it just goes down to the end. Yeah. So... Who's walking in with them? I don't know. This guy's walking Something. in. Alex. Uh, sorry, that's not his Soren. Name. Soren's walking in. Soren is walking in. All right, these it. two. As everyone. They're doing walking everything. to this point. Okay, so who? who are, okay, first of all, I guess are you splitting the party? Hold on, that's what I'm trying to divide. I say, yeah. Rand's not going in there. Um. Yeah, you're sitting over here. Well, actually, I'll sit. I'm sitting right here. Sit right here. Okay, that's where I am. All right, you're behind the fountain. Yep. And kind of behind Mr. Orc. I just ain't going Orc in that face. door. Yeah, you're not touching that, and you're not touching this door. So, all right, I'm going to stand just inside this door. 
mm-hmm. with my bow, like ready out here. I can shoot out here, but I'm, I'm inside this door. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. they're gonna broke. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> it's cool. By the way, that corner piece is not actually there. I just screwed up the sign. This? No, this. This actual corner. Yeah, piece I figured that one out. Okay. I figured that one out. Um, All right, so you got four doors here. We're gonna open room 11 first. Room 11. All right, I will need a lockpick check, please. Oh, yeah, same guy. Because these doors are all locked, and they're pretty nice locks. It's a 14. Plus 11. Plus 11, 11 is enough. Uh, it takes him a little bit, but he he fixed the lock. Click. And it's, it's open. It's good to go. From 11, they move into it. Mm hmm. Perception? Perception, uh, what's their passive? What's the passive perception? 12 and 14. Okay. That's that's fine. Yeah. Um, there is a little bit of dust in this room, but it's from uh, dry, decaying skin, because there are five skeletons in this room. They're not alive or anything. There's dead skeletons yeah. laying. Yeah. Um, give me an, an investigation check. For each character. For each character that's in there. 20. Andy. Okay. And an 11 plus second guy. What was that investigation? 11 plus 4. That makes it 15. 20 and a 15. Okay. They both okay. notice something. 20 gets yeah. some dice. So who will roll the 20? Uh, the first guy in. Um, Kyrian. Kyrian. Okay. Um, in the center of the room, there are two gold ingots, and it looks like these skeletons uh, killed each other over the gold. There's two like like there's hands there's, on it, there's, basically there's right there. And necks and there's, and there's a few others around yeah. the edge. It was it was a brutal fight, from from what you can kind mm-hmm. of see. It was like blood staining. Do these skeletons look the same? Yes. Like same species as what I'm talking about. Yeah, they're all human. All right. So, I guess they're gonna walk in and just grab one gold bar each, and there's nothing else in the room, right? They, right. All right, so they walk in. Okay. Yep. Now we're gonna play their characters like they would probably play their characters. Yeah. Because no one else is with them, they're probably not gonna say that they got as much gold as they found. Oh no, they they're gonna walk in here. They said, like, yeah, we found a couple coins. So like two copper. No one would have made any estimations when they saw that. I'm just gold. saying they would have walked in, grabbed those, made them disappear. You have no idea what they found in here. Mm-hmm. It, it was two copper. I'm just saying, like, like some this was some old dusty go, building. You walk I mean, in here, find two copper. Like, game that you find it here. Yeah, find four copper. It might be eight copper in that room. All right. All right. Uh, that's what they walked in here and grabbed. Okay. That's all you know. So they walk into this building. Alright, they're gonna walk out. Um Which one now? Nothing nothing else happens? No. Alright, well I wanna go to room five. You wanna move around? Yeah. I wanna go into room five. Room five. Room five is a weapon storage room. Oh. Okay. And there are shurikens. Yeah. In there. On the weapon there's like a big weapon rack on yep. the wall. There's like there's a couple of daggers, there's some short swords, some scimitars, <clears throat> there's a bow. None of it's magical really. It's just like standard weapons. Yeah. There's some there's some shurikens that are next to the daggers. Okay. How many are there? There are ten. ten. Okay, I'll take them. Alright. Um, give me a perception check when you pick up the shurikens, please. That is a six or a nine. It's a six. Yeah. Yeah. Plus perception. Plus perception is a two. 